Stop acknowledging the people you know that these are my end. Just ignore them. If you ignore them, you focus more on what can make you happy. But if you continue thinking about those who are disturbing your peace, those who are making you not to feel good, then what are you getting out of that? Anyone who wants to stand and do the right thing attracts persecutions. If you want to live a normal and straight life, you become the enemy of so many people. Even when you are collecting them, they will cook another story against you. If you hear them talking about you within your company, at your working place, at your neighborhood, ignore them and seek the problem solver. Because Jesus knows their weakness. He knows their secrets. But if you say, okay, let me challenge you. I'll take you to court. I'll do this and that. What are you doing to yourself? You are destroying yourself. Because the same platform that you want to use is the same platform where they are standing. And two wrong cannot make it what? Right. Stop acknowledging those things that cannot support your future. Pay more attention to Jesus who knows you better than anyone. Sometimes you go somewhere, you are looking for something. You are expecting people to treat you like a, a king and a queen. Then they will address you like a, a, a small child. Let them treat you like a fool. Ignore their foolishness. You get there. That's where they will know you that. Ah, ah. So this is the man or this is the woman. If you want to ashamed the devil, even those who do not expect you to greet them, greet them. Whether they will answer you or not, devil is ashamed. That is the character of a child of God who is more focused than seeking this respect of this world. Stop promoting your personality. Stop promoting your character. Let Jesus be the one to promote you. He will raise you from ashes to the grace. From company to that side. If you ignore your enemy, don't pay attention to what can bring you down. Instead, seek the one who can solve that problem. The one who is greater than your problem. The one who is more powerful than that pain disturbing you every night. Stop acknowledging the foolishness of Satan and focus on Jesus.